Okay, that stay tuned kind of turned out the way all of the stay tunes have worked out for Trump. Oh yeah, you'll get his health care plan in two weeks, circa eight years ago. You'll get his infrastructure plan in two weeks, stay tuned. His position on abortion at the federal level, stay tuned, you'll find out. No, that just means you're not gonna hear anything because nothing's coming. And that is true of Melania as well, because they indicated there that she'll be doing more and 99% of that Totally inaccurate. She's actually around him even less than she was previously for understandable reasons. Now, it's not saying that she's not doing anything. She has done fundraisers for the log cabin Republicans. She's completed one, she's planning another. That is something. It seems designed to anger Donald Trump more than anything else. But that was in March that that came out. We are now months later. He's gone through multiple trials, he's facing more. The election is coming up, the debate. Will she be there at the debate? Seems like a perfectly reasonable time for the wife of a candidate to show up. I'm kind of doubting that it's gonna happen. The video will continue in just a moment, but first I have a message for you. TYT needs your help. Membership is vital to survival. So please go to tyt.com team and become a member today. According to Melaniaologists, which are apparently a thing, <laughs> they were surveyed by Axios. They speculated that she would most likely spend a potential second term splitting time between Palm Beach and New York, where Sun Baron is rumored to be attending NYU. So she's not there for the campaign. She's not gonna be in the White House the second time around. Bear in mind, she hadn't been in the White House for the first period of his first term. But even that explanation that she would be in New York because, oh, Barron's gonna be at NYU. Well, yeah, but they fly like it's nothing. And it's only to go to DC if you wanted to visit or hell, he could take the train. Right. Does she really need to be living in New York just to occasionally see Barron? But again, that's the cover story. I don't need the cover story. She's not around him because she's disgusted by him. I'm sure that the, the Stormy Daniels trial was really rough on her. I, I have empathy for that. Um, they say, these Melaniologists, that she doesn't really see the first lady role as important. It's unelected, not paid. She might do like a state dinner or something, but otherwise Melania does what Melania wants. And I think that's the case. I think she will, if he goes back to the White House, be like the most vacant first lady in American history. And I sort of get why, but what do you think? Yeah, I mean, I don't, I'm not a free Melania person, but Look, let her live her damn life. The rumor also, and the Melaniologists know this, was that she was probably gonna divorce him before he was elected president. And then she's like, okay, someone has to do Christmas, even though I hate it, I hate Christmas. <laughs> um, and so there, no, she, oh God, the smell, imagine the smell. I'm yeah. just thinking of her in the smell. Um, and we all know that the Trumps think that the Oval Office, or the White House, excuse me, is dumpy. Uh, the Oval Office being a part of it, but the White House is just dumpy, gross. So she wants to be in Palm Beach. She wants to be in New York. Yeah. Um, and yeah, this makes total sense. You know what, John? I've been thinking about this. Isn't it amazing? Again, back to Gaslight City, because that's sort of where we live. But the fact that everyone freaked out about Hillary Clinton and still do for staying with Bill, I don't care. I truly mm -hmm. don't care. And it's like not anywhere near the reasons that I do not like Hillary Clinton. But meanwhile, who is telling Melania like, how dare you? The Democrats aren't like, wow, I can't believe she's staying with Trump. No, we're saying that because of, again, the smell, but not because <laughs> he cheated on her multiple times, right? Like, no, yeah. the right doesn't, again, we are in Gaslight City and I don't 100%. like it. Yeah, that's where she'll be splitting her time actually. Thanks for watching our video. Did you know that you can support our show by becoming a subscriber? Just click the subscribe button and also ring the bell so that you get notifications when we're live or when we post new content.